सेफ एंड साउंड सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस कपल ऑफ न्यू फीचर्स ऑफ सीक्रो सफर ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फाइव सो विदाउट एनी डिले स्टार्ट द वीडियो सो बिफोर स्टार्टिंग द वीडियो प्लीज गो टू चैनल एंड प्लीज लाइक टू सब्सक्राइब एंड डोंट फॉरगेट टू शेयर विद अदर्स प्लीज विजिट द चैनल प्ले लिस्ट हेयर सो यू विल गेट द लॉट ऑफ यू नो मोर देन टू हंड्रेड वीडियोज फॉर सीक्रो सफर ओके let me start the session today hope you guys able to see the screen okay so let me adjust a little bit so here we are going to discuss about today the uh, sequel of our new features of 2025 so these are uh, as we know uh, many features we have uh, you know uh, which is enhanced in uh, 2025 but these three component which is totally new uh, this is added something new in this 2025 which is not in a previous uh, version okay so uh, as we all aware uh, sequel server introduced 2025 in normal 2024 and SQL Server now becomes has a AI readable database along with the adding new AI capabilities. Okay, and they are providing the now the world class security features including the better, uh, no credential management. So these three components, the built in AI and enhanced security and performance and integration with Microsoft Azure, Arc and Fabric. So we will discuss in this session. so this is the diagram which is which i have created to you know uh, what are the three major component which is totally changed this these features not in a uh, previous version okay uh, so couple of component which is uh, you know enhanced in 2025 but this is totally new for 2025 so uh, build in ai capability best security and performance and integration with azure service like azure arc and microsoft Fab fabric so build in ai what is that actually if you go in this lines in details so the the major component is what 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 we can achieve here right so so there is no need for a special code or logic for in you know integrating the various uh, external services rather than everything can be done through the database itself using the flexible ai model management okay so it can engine itself have the capabilities you know so you should not write any extra code and all to you know uh, integrate with the ai okay so this is the very very important features and it can be changed drastically very a uh, lot of things actually so we should go in details with this features right building ai so this is the you know major uh, Uh, you can say the flow chart or diagram what are the features we can achieve uh, building ai capabilities so uh, with this approach you can easily understand what are the things we can achieve and and then we you should uh, all we all should go each and everything in details right so rest api integration tsql the graph uh, uh, integration tsql and vector search hybrid search and simplification of reg and you know to improve the semantic search and ai framework integration so these are the major component which can achieve through the built in ai capabilities so now the task is we should go each and everything in details right this is a just an overview what are the things we can achieve through the bi uh, built in ai capability this is the one of the interview question also if you you say uh, we have interview uh, we have now built in ai capabilities in sql server 2025 so they will ask the major component what what are the things uh, we can achieve through this bi capability so we can show them this uh, based on this uh, flow chart right uh, the enhanced security performance you can see here the sql 2025 comes with a lot of security enhanced performance similarly uh, here we have the chart what are the things we have in enhanced security performance uh, in 2025 so identity and access management the secure outbound connection enhanced query optimization dynamic parameter sens sensitivity execution plan column stored ind indexing is now improved the batch processing is now improved transaction id and log after the qualification this is very very one of the major component which is enhanced actually in 2025 which is helping to the reducing the blocking and all right deadlock 
the real time events uh, you know streaming and the command query responsibility segregation so these are the factors and now the task is each and every we should go in details to understand the things how it is differ from the previous version okay we cannot cover in all things in a single video so this is one of the uh, you know just for you know introduction what if you say the security and performance enhancement so what are the things enhanced in a, in terms of security and performance so you can go with each and every parameter in details so significant improvement uh, few three uh, three significant improvement which is helped a lot uh, from the previous version so these are the four five component which is you know significantly change and improve the performance in terms either you can say the batch processing model which improve the cpu you know and if you see say the column store index from the previous version it Im improved a lot and which i was talking about this the transaction id and alq which is really improved uh, you know in this uh, locking and blocking in terms of so we should go in details what are the things here changed and explore more on this okay so these are the parameters which Im significantly improved in terms of security and performance enhancement okay the third is integration with microsoft azure arc and fabric so this is also one of the major component so now you can see here uh, you go in details but i will give you this examples actually so let's say uh, a person having running with the you know retail business having the 10 store okay now uh, they want you know uh, uh, the managing the 10 store uh, data whatever the data and the you know, business uh, through the single point of uh, uh, views so what will say azure arc will be a centralized unified platform to manage the, all the 10 store centrally you will apply the consistent security policies, update performance, centralize, uh, and, da and data analytics, the real-time integration and you know re resource optimization. So this is the centralized way to manage the all the 10 stores. So so this kind of you know f uh, component can use for such kind of need. Okay. So we go with all the details in details for Azure Arc and Microsoft Fabric also again same go for uh, with this examples and lines and try to understand what are the features and also explore more on these topics okay and try to figure out where, wherever it's suitable to your projects okay so my you know assumption is today just to give you the overview <coughs> what three components which is changed uh, totally from the previous version and what are the things enhanced so you can see uh, here the security in terms of security these are the factors uh, para parameters which is enhanced signif significantly so you can also try to figure out and wherever possible to suitable for your projects try to apply it okay so that's it for today we'll meet uh, soon till then bye bye and keep watching and keep keep exploring and keep learning for these all parameters okay thank you guys